Nowadays, many of us are working abroad. We are traveling abroad. We are studying abroad or we're simply living abroad. And when you are doing any of these things, you want to be able to feel good and look good. And you also need to be autonomous because sometimes you can't bring the products that you have from your home country to where you might be. Whenever I come or arrive in a new country, I always look for the grocery store. And the grocery store will have a section of hair care products. Any, anywhere in the world that you go to that's a, a, a city, a, a fairly large city, you'll have hair care products and all hair care products in the world are the same. They have three components, just three. They have the solvent, which is what everything is dissolved in, the liquidy part. They have what I call a system of surfactants, or these are uh, active ingredients. And then the third component is what I call additives, stuff that doesn't do anything for your hair, colors, thickeners, thinners, um, smells, preservatives. This is the additive section and so you can ignore that unless you have an allergy to some components that are constantly in the additive section. And the first thing that I look at, no matter what type of product it is, and I'll start off with this one, is I always go to the first line of the ingredients. The first line will always have the solvent, and it can usually be water or deionized water or propylene glycol. And then, usually, the next component will be the most important or most active ingredient in that product. If it is a shampoo, you're going to have surfactants or ingredients that clean. If you have a keratin treatment or any type of straightening treatment, you want to keep that hair as straight as possible. So it's best for you to use a sulfate free shampoo and conditioner. That would be the same for someone also who has color in his or her hair. By the way, there is one exception. The exception to the rule, hair pomades. Hair grease, hair pomades, things like this, they tend to not follow that rule. What they tend to have is petrolatum, petroleum, some type of mineral oil usually is in the first line or is used as the solvent. All right now, so go out there and conquer the world. Don't be afraid, do your thing. Work the things the way you need to work them and do it beautifully with uh, confidence and style and comfort and perhaps not comfort but the way uh, that shows the world all your fabulousness. All your fabulousness. All right now.